In August 2022, the Secretary of State for Leveling Up, Housing and Communities announced that the government were willing to enter into a devolution deal with Derbyshire County Council, Nottinghamshire County Council, Derby City Council, and Nottingham City Council. The devolution arrangements would cover Derbyshire, Nottinghamshire, Derby City, and Nottingham City. Under the devolution proposal, the two counties and the two cities would get local control of £1.14 billion of funding to improve the lives of people who live in this area. It would mean that people who know and understand our area will make decisions across key subjects, such as the economy, housing and regeneration, skills and transport, in and for Derbyshire, Nottinghamshire, Derby and Nottingham, Devolution is designed to bring significant benefits to our urban and rural communities, to improve people's quality of life and help us drive green economic growth as we move towards being carbon neutral. It would create a new combined county authority for Derbyshire, Nottinghamshire, Derby City and Nottingham City, led by a new elected mayor for the area. The combined county authority would include representatives from local councils, it would not replace existing councils, which would continue, and would still represent residents in their areas, as they do now. For devolution to occur the four councils must agree to the deal in principle, set out their plans locally, and carry out a public consultation on the role and function of the combined county authority. A consultation about devolution is currently taking place, on behalf of Derbyshire County Council, Nottinghamshire County Council, Derby City Council, and Nottingham City Council. This consultation will inform the Council's decision on whether to move forward with devolution and our report and recommendation to the Secretary of State, who, if satisfied with our plans, will pass legislation to approve the deal. So, what is devolution? Devolution involves the transfer of money and functions from Whitehall and central government to our area, to enable decisions that are a priority locally to be made locally. A mayor, elected to serve local people, communities, and businesses, and the combined county authority, can make these decisions. The four councils in Derbyshire, Nottinghamshire, Derby and Nottingham entered into an in-principle devolution deal, working with key partners, including district and borough councils, to hear their views and gather their input. The four councils voted to move forward with devolution by going to the consultation stage and judged that the proposed new model would have a positive impact on the interests of local communities. The four councils have published a proposal document that sets out the combined county authorities' proposed role and functions. This proposal document is the basis of the consultation and for establishing a future combined county authority in the East Midlands. It is a key part of the process required by law to make changes to current local governance arrangements. The eight-week consultation is to gather your views on the scheme. Here's a summary of the key elements that are under consultation. 1. Proposed new governance arrangements. The proposal would mean Derbyshire County Council, Nottinghamshire County Council, Derby City Council and Nottingham City Council would establish a new mayoral combined county authority that would be led by a new elected mayor. 2. New transport powers to improve and integrate the area's transport network. The devolution proposal would give the mayor and mayoral combined county authority new responsibilities and powers to invest in transport infrastructure, including public transport. This will help Derbyshire, Nottinghamshire, Derby and Nottingham to develop a more effective and efficient transport system for the long term. 3. Housing and Regeneration the devolution proposal would give the mayor and mayoral combined county authority responsibilities for housing and regeneration. 4. Skills and employment. The devolution proposal would give the mayor and mayoral combined county authority responsibilities and powers to help people and businesses in Derbyshire, Nottinghamshire, Derby, and Nottingham to get the skills and support necessary to reach their ambitions, as well as support the area's economy. 5. New funding and finance functions. The proposal for devolution would give the area an extra £38 million a year for 30 years. That's £1.14 billion in total, from central government to spend on local priorities. 
6. Improved funding and working relationships to drive our ambitions to be a carbon neutral area. The proposal for devolution would give support Derbyshire, Nottinghamshire, Derby, and Nottingham's ambition to be carbon neutral. The consultation is running between the 14th of November 2022 and the 9th of January 2023, and we want to know what you think. Devolution could bring about important change in our area, so it is important for you to have your say. You can do this by completing our online consultation survey, or you can complete a paper copy of the consultation. More information about the key elements and how to respond can be found at www.eastmidlandsdevolution.co.uk. Gathering your views is a vital part of the process and we very much look forward to receiving your responses.